It was almost exactly 50 years ago that we first landed on the moon, and we have a program this year with the Philharmonic that's celebrating our solar system and the universe and the cosmos. It's a program centered around Holst planets, the Holst planets. Um, this is a piece that uh, every single movement is actually named after a planet in the solar system, and they're little vignettes that are supposed to sort of depict the feelings we get from these planets. And one of my favorite things about this performance is that UCF, their female choir, is joining us for Neptune, the last movement of this piece. It's one of the most gorgeous moments when a wordless female choir joins the orchestra. And UCF is actually starting the concert off with a piece by Bartok, three sketches, and they're very fun, sort of um, folk music oriented. And we're very excited and very lucky that Kehan Kalhor, the Persian Kemanche player who was with us about two years ago and blew the roof off the plaza, is joining us for this concert. He's playing a piece that he wrote called Blue as the Turquoise Night of Neshabur. It's a piece that the Silk Road Ensemble recorded about 20 years ago with Yo Yo Ma. It's one of the most beautiful pieces. Watching and listening to how a man from Persia looks up and addresses his cosmos and the, and the colors and the sounds that he's able to draw out of the orchestra and getting to see an English composer, Holst, look up and see planets and decide how to depict those planets with sounds is something that we're excited about putting together on the same concert.